Now it's time to take a look at augmented grand piano from uh, Arturia. And like I said before, they've they've kind of stepping, uh, dipping their toes into sampling and then bringing it together with all of the things that they do so well with uh, their synthesis. Like, it's almost like they married a sampling engine and pigments together. Uh, that's, that's what it kind of looks like to me. So I'm just gonna pull up the Acoustic Grand reinvent it and see what happens. See where augmented grand piano is going to take us. And I'm going to make sure that I do not have anything else in the mix. So now let's do it. Let's do this. Here we go. I'm going to hit that E flat again. This is just augmented grand. And we've got these center controls. These are like macro controls. And we go here. And this just affects the blend. And so you can see if we're all the way over to the, um, as I'm looking at it, all the way over to the gold side, the more classical side, then that's like a mixer and then if you bring it all the way over, it's the synthetic here. And then you just go. Take it over to the just the synthetic. So the mod wheel kind of controls some of the modulation effects. You can hear it, or CC1. Now I'm going to pull this in the middle just to kind of get a blend of the, um, the acoustic and the augmented part. It's like a tremolo and it speeds up the more you push the mod wheel forward. Okay, let's go some more. Ooh, okay, wait a second. Yeah, you hear it just kind of doing some really wild things. Uh, let's go to um, Moderna. Yeah. I'm in the wrong key. Here we go. Jones, man. When I hear that tone and when I hear that piano tone, it reminds me of that. And you want to, yes, you want to. to blame yeah 
That's fun. <laughs> That's a lot of fun. Okay, let's just, uh, let's push the... Okay, now the mod wheel will bring like some chorusing to it. Yes, another one without context, Steph, exactly right. I like this. Different pianos, different libraries, different manufacturers have their own fingerprint and they each do something different. Each, it just, each of them triggers something different inside of this, whatever's going on up here. <laughs> and it creates different things to come out. It's amazing, beautiful, uh, really cool. And then we can go in and adjust more of the micro knobs and um, the delays and reverbs. And then in proportion to this, uh, this knob here, it, it affects how much, uh, these are going, uh, and you've got all of these different things that you can do. Same preset. I just mess with some. And see how it just takes you to another place. Okay, let's just go on um, to a couple more of these. Um, uh, ultimate, ultimate. Yes, that's that's correct. Yes, so the Arteria libraries are NKS compatible. So if you've got complete control or keyboards or machine, they'll interface really cool with that. Yeah, so this is just mainly like one of your standard pianos. Yeah, I'm still on augmented RAN. So, um, Alessandro, I'm actually running this inside of my DAW, um, run it inside of Cakewalk by BandLab. And then the mod wheel is controlling the filtering here. So the mod wheel is doing the filter. Mm -hmm. 
And I think you can automate that uh, with MIDI. Uh, you have control. Uh, let's go over here and let me pop out the, um, you've got uh, all the MIDI settings that you can uh, assign all of the different uh, effects controls to, um, to your CC controller and just have hands-on even has some tutorials there if, you, if you'd like to. Uh, so we only have 12 voices polyphony here uh, so far, but you know, the more polyphony you have, um, you know, let's just do, let's do 32 polyphony. That's going to, um, it's going to tweak this little um, panic. Well, it's going to trigger the uh, CPU meter down here because sometimes this, that's what I've noticed about some of the augmented pianos or augmented series that it can get a little CPU uh, intensive sometimes. Okay, so let's, let's, so this is called Poppy. Oh, wow. That is fat. That is fat. Yeah. Yeah, George, it is um, it is compatible with Mac. I think it has something to do. It sounds like it's got some octaves going on here. Let's uh, go to the advanced page and just kind of see what's going on. Yeah, so here we have, um, we have the different, uh, we've got two different layers, A and B. Okay, so we've got uh, sampler, sampler and synth, and then you've got sampler and synth on both of these. Um, this is amazing. Yeah, so you've got the synth function, and then you look down here, and it just kind of looks like um, uh, pigments. Uh, yeah, that's what it reminds me of. So it's just like a big stack, piano stack. And let's see. We've got a little bit of detuned here, and then um, just, yeah, there's, it, it's just like you just, you, you open this advanced tab and it just throws you into another world. And then here in the macro section, this is where we have uh, control over what that center knob does. We can have a little finer control over that. And then, um, then we've got uh, two different effects processors for the layers. And that sounds kind of quirky by itself, but when you layer it with the piano layer, just like 50-50, Turn the motion. Okay. Nigel, that's a good idea. That's a good idea. Let me see if I can pull this, pull up. Uh, augmented strings in here. 
Yeah, that's what I love about these live streams because um, I love when you guys uh, participate. And um, yeah, so I've got augmented strings. And let's just, let's uh, lay that in there. Okay, so here's augmented strings. So this is just right out of the box uh, with, um, let's go back to the Acoustic Grand. Uh, let's see, let me see. Let me see if we've got just a um, simple piano here. Let's just go to a, just a classic reinvented. <laughs> This is um, classic reinvented. Very nice together. Very nice together. Let's uh, let's just go. Let's just kind of uh, do something kind of crazy with both of these, and then um, you know it's not um, it's not acoustic piano in the traditional traditional sense. Um, I think, uh, and I'm just trying to see if I can find, um, okay, okay, so this is, let's just see. Let's just see what, um, what this one sounds like. Okay, I'm gonna turn off the uh, strings just for a second, and we can kind of come back and kind of play. Okay, here we go. Now this is kind of, This is not um, this is not your traditional um, this is like more the felted type of thing yeah yeah Nigel it's not tr traditional it's augmented um, interesting it is interesting let's just see if we can I I have felt it and let's see Lost Soul, let's see what this one sounds like. Okay, this is kind of, this kind of sounds a little more traditional. I want to um, see what we've got here. Main, so we've got the reverb here.
Let's turn off the... Uh, Now, there we go. That's a little more. And uh, Chris, I've actually got the, um, I've got the reverb and delay turned off here. And this has, uh, layer B has a little phaser. Uh, we've got a little um, EQ on there. Yeah. And I'm, like I said, I'm just still getting, um, getting my feet uh, wet with this. Now, while we've while we've got this here, let's uh, let's go ahead and just turn that string layer back on with augmented strings and uh, hear what uh, what happens when we layer these two together. Oh yeah.
So I'm at uh, 30, 28% here. Yeah. So uh, on the piano, it's like 15, 20%. So the augmented strings and piano, they just kind of go together. Listen how fat That's why I love these joyful dreams. That's why I love these joyful dreams. That's why I love these joyful dreams. That's why I love these joyful journeys I never know where we might go next I just hear the music in my fingers And I let the sounds do the rest My friends come along with me We've got places to go and people to see <laughs> People to see that we love so dear That's why I love these joyful journeys Layering this with the uh, with the augmented strings is just takes it just takes it to another level. Yeah. 
And then the movement, all the different modulation sources and things. Yeah, this is great. Yeah, Peaches, I've got uh, I've got augmented strings and augmented piano uh, layered together. Um, yeah, it's just wonderful. It's just wonderful. <laughs> and we're just we I mean, we're just, we could just stay on this for uh, you know you can stay on things like this for you know for a long time. And it's just beautiful. It just takes you so many different places. You know, like I say all the time, I just pull up the sound and I hear it and it just it just takes you somewhere. These are, these, I mean, they're musical vehicles and they take you into um, so many different things. Wow. Thank you guys so much. Uh, thank you. Moonlight Sonata <clears throat> and Winter Heat, it's good to see you on, on the live. First time I've played that. Yeah. So it is moving around quite a bit. I've got that motion. I've got the motion turned up a lot. Sometimes I forget to, to turn it back back down. And I'm still layering this with the augmented strings and you can you can hear what a fabulous uh, sound that is together. Yeah, interesting. Thank you all so much.
for spending some time together with me and uh, it is just always uh, such a privilege. Make sure you check out all the links in the description. Augmented Grand, it's just more, there's just so much inside of that, uh, so many layers. It's just like an onion that you can just keep digging and pulling.